So I watched Joker for Lee Adu and here is my review. Hello everyone, it's Video Talk here with a new video. So today I decided to watch Joker for Lee Adu um, to see if the movie is as bad as people were saying. Sorry if it's a bit echoey in here, but um, yeah, here's my review. It's actually okay. Um, one thing I didn't like about the film, a few things I didn't like about the film. Firstly, why was it a musical? It didn't need to be a musical. The first movie wasn't a musical. Some of the music was okay though, but um, yeah. Um, another thing uh, uh, I didn't like about the film is, uh, I don't know if I can say another bad thing about it. I'm still trying to process everything that happened. Um, but here's a little spoiler if you haven't watched the film. So if you haven't watched the film, um, please click off this video, go watch the film, and then come back to this video. Joker isn't actually Joker. And I'm still confused. Um, I'll have to watch some uh, YouTubers review the movie um, very soon. But one of the things I did like about the film is that the film was shot well. Um, the explosion towards the endish part of the film, once again, spoilers, wasn't too bad. It was a pretty cool explosion. But uh, that was shown in the trailer and I um, didn't even know that it was gonna happen um, in the courthouse because I thought it was gonna be a part of like Arthur Fleck's dream. Um, because in the film, he has dreams of him singing along with Harley. And another spoiler, Harley does break up with Joker towards the end of the film. And uh, yeah, once again, there's still so much going off my mind right now. I still need to process. Um, but uh, if you are a fan of the DC comics, or if you have watched the first Joker film and you want to watch the second one, be my guest. But um, the film is okay. It isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be, since all the people saying it, it's bad. Um, but yeah, there were deleted scenes in the film, like for example, that elevator scene from the first Joker film um, revealed, um, sorry if I'm starring there, but um, in Joker 2, there was supposed to be a scene of Harley turning into Harley Quinn. Why wasn't that in the film? That would be a really cool um, part if that was in the film. Another thing I didn't like about the film is um, they cut the scene where Joker and Harley were dancing on the stairs. Why did they have to cut that? They showed that in the trailer, but then they cut it from the film. I didn't even see it when I went to go see the film. Why, why did they cut it? No idea. Um, another deleted scene I saw on the YouTube video was Harley dancing in the st on the stairs, um, actually singing a song with police officers behind her. Um, don't know why that was cut too. Um, once again, I'm not Warner Brothers and it's Warner Brothers' decision. Um, but yeah, people don't really like Joker 2. And in my opinion, Joker 2 isn't good, but it, it's sort of in the middle. Um, I'd rate the movie a 5 or 4 out of 10. I'd rate it a 4 out of 10. Regardless if the movie's a little bad, I'll still be buying it on DVD, regardless if the movie's bad. Well, regardless. <laughs> The movie is bad. Um, but oh uh, yeah guys, that's basically it for this video. Um, let me know in the comments what film I should see next. Um, a little bit of a announcement, I'm going to go see Venom The Last Dance um, on October 26th I think. I'll have to think about the date. But anyway, yeah guys, that's basically it for this video and I'm going to end it here now. So hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please make sure as always like the video and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And turn on post notifications so you don't miss a video from me. But uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.